the alternate catalog mapping, known as ACM, will redirect catalog queries to either views or shadow tables. This can improve performance in a number of CADB2 tools products and the need for select authorization to the catalog. Let's see how easy you create an ACM definition. Select option M to create or update an alternate catalog map. You will see a list of the existing ACM definitions. To create a new ACM, just enter the name and a description and press enter. And you will see a panel like this. You can easily define the new tables or views by typing a new creator and an equal sign. Creator is changed for all catalog tables. Press PF3 to save the ACM definition and leave the panel. Use line command M, make tab, to create the shadow tables. We will later see how to use views instead of tables. In this example, we will create both the database with the shadow tables, and the load unload control cards. The script is being generated online, and ready to submit, as a batch job. All the DDL has been generated. Ready to create all shadow tables, with table spaces and indexes, and the utility cards to copy data from the catalog. Note, that you need not create all catalog tables as shadow tables, to use ACM. Using a mix is not a problem and works completely transparently. Just make sure the shadow tables are in sync with the catalog. You may want to set up a routine to make sure the shadow tables are always up to date. Or use views instead. Many sites prefer to use views on the catalog tables rather than having to copy the catalog into the shadow tables. This way all information is always up to date. However, the real benefit with views comes if you use views with a where clause to limit the search. Let's see how. Here is an example of an ACM view with a where clause. And another one, a little more complex. The use of views with where clauses can have a significant impact on the performance. This is especially the case when analyzing RC migrator compare strategies, where requirement for memory could be a problem. However, you need to carefully consider how the views are created to avoid problems when only accessing a subset of the catalog. On CA support site you can find a document with all views for DB2 version 10, ready for your customization. Now let us see how you can invoke ACM. In general you enable ACM from the main menu. And in RC query, you will see this notification. Here you can also use these two commands to toggle between ACM modes. In other products, you need to specify the ACM you want to use like this example from RC Migrator, with both a source and target ACM, to create the RC Compare strategy. Also note command ACM, that can be used from several products to show the status. You can find more information in the manual or online documentation. Thank you for taking time to watch this video.